the song that just takes to that final play and what you saw and how it felt when the ball went through the net? Uh, yeah, I told Dev, Coach Devin, like, uh, leave me in the game. Uh, we ran the play, the play broke down. Uh, I got the ball and I was just counting uh, from five down in my head. And I kind of got a little bit of room, like kind of pump fake a little bit and shot it. And I, I knew it was good when, when, I, when I shot the ball, so. Uh, how did it feel? I mean, it felt amazing. It's, it's a great feeling to hit a, a game winner in the game. Uh, when was the last time you hit a shot like that? Yeah. Probably in prep school. Hey, sorry, guys. Can y'all unmute me? Probably. <laughs> yeah, man, I got you. You can hear us? You hear us? Yeah, thanks. Yeah, yeah. Probably, probably sure. in prep school. That was the last time I hit one. It felt amazing. Andre, uh, from your angle, what did you see on the play? And, uh, the game uh, like I said, uh, it broke down. Didn't get the look that we wanted. And then... Oz was a playmaker. Uh, he did his thing. He hit the shot. I was on the right of him, actually. Um, good feeling for real. I, I don't know. That was really good to start off <laughs> the year. Good team. So it was, it was a good win. Uh, double OT. That was a, was a really good shot. Really happy for him. And uh, what about the celebration? What, what was going on in the corner? Uh, yeah. That, that kind of hurt a little bit. I ain't going to lie. Hurt me for yeah, sure. I was, I was <laughs> laying. Uh, it, was, it, was, it was good, though. Um, I, we haven't done that in a while. I don't think we've done that yet. No, I don't think so. No, don't that, think was, that, was, that was big time. Uh, earlier, or about halfway through the second half, uh, ACU went on a 10 0 run. Uh, what happened defensively, breakdown that, that kind of led to that kind of shift of the game? Um, from what I've seen, uh, when we were switching, we weren't switching aggressively enough. Uh, our switch was soft, so they were able to slip them, and, and that's how they got open layups, and that's how they went on their run. Yeah, uh, our defense broke down a little bit. We got to catch everything with our chest. That's uh, talk, touch, switch, grab is like kind of our philosophy. So, uh, kind of broke down a little bit towards the second half, and we picked it up. Uh, we knew that we had to pick it up, uh, just start playing more aggressive, and just. Like I said, catching everything with our chest when we switch. And then, um, what does it say about the team to be able to respond after giving up the lead and then being able to hang in the game and ultimately win it? Definitely showed a lot of fight today. You know, we showed a lot of heart. Uh, we definitely showed that we could win tough games, win close games. And if it's going to be a dog fight, we're ready to fight with each other. Yeah. Shows maturity for real. Um, got a lot of young guys. Uh, we got a couple old guys, but we got a lot of young guys. So it does show that we can um, play through adversity, um, play with each other. Um, there was times when people's heads were down, but Q being a leader, uh, Boots being a leader, just influencing everybody to keep the chin up and just keep pushing. How special does it feel to uh, get that win for uh, Coach Johnson, make sure he goes 2-0 and in his uh, short stint as a head coach? Texan? Definitely feel special for him. You know, I'm happy for him. You know, our relationship is amazing. So he, he, I don't know many undefeated coaches yeah, in the yeah. nation, but yeah. I, I know <laughs> Coach Devin Johnson is one of them. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. good 2-0 no feeling. Wait, it's a good start to the season. Um, he did a good job. Like you said, we're really close with him, so we're happy for him. Are you all good? Okay, so we're going to Can I jump in here now? Yeah, yeah for sure. Yeah, questions are Sweet. good now. Oh, yeah, hey, uh, so I sorry if I missed at the beginning, but who was that uh, play drawn up for throw to play, and uh, what were you hoping to get out of it instead of the, the three? Um, so the play was actually to have Ethan set a ball screen and slip the ball screen, uh, but they blacked it really well. And second option was for me to come in the corner and knock the shot down. Uh, but like we said, it broke down, uh, not the way we wanted to, and Hassan Diaro. Uh, showed out and you know hit a big shot for us. And what uh, uh, what does it say about Ty Tyrese and the couple times that when there's key situations they had he also had ISO set up for him and uh, for some guy the guy who's new on the team to be able to have those clutch situations on his shoulders as well. <clears throat> you know Ty is a great player for us. You know he he's a, he's a bully. So you know whenever we could go to him he's gonna score the ball regardless. I I feel like. Anybody who's guarding, whether they're bigger, he's faster than them. If they're smaller, he's stronger than them. So I felt like he's just a mismatch problem, and that's why we went to him a lot lately. Anything else, Josh? Thanks, guys. Good. Uh, Josh, what's the 
So, appreciate y'all. Thank, Thank you, guys. You.